Hey everybody, it's Goddess Shillian and I'm in my infrared sauna vlog trying to chill out. <clears throat> so we just got through the Halloween All Hallows Eve weekend with this huge full moon in Taurus which is about what's really important to us and it's felt very intense and the intensity is growing because Tuesday, election day, um, tomorrow, <laughs> Mercury starts going direct. Okay, that's a positive thing, but during a Mercury changing directions period, it can be absolute chaos. Whew. Okay, add to that this massive Pluto transit that's coming later in the week, which will be the third time this year that these massive outer planets have come together. And we could just, it feels like we're reaching a point of sort of no return, obviously, the election. But um, what I want to tell everybody today, and it's so important because I had to take like a week off just to get my own <sighs> clarity and connection with the divine and disconnect from a lot of what's boiling all around because there is so much negativity. There is so much hate and that is literally the lowest vibration just about that you can have I think probably is so this is what I want to tell people and and I pray because by the time this video gets up it'll already be in play fully in play it already is in play um, please come from your heart consider what is going to make us feel better and raise our vibration is it hate and division and fear and prejudice against others because they're different than us and all of these feelings that really just keep us keep us tethered to this lower vibrational energy in the third dimension see because right now it's all about ascension we are literally have come into a place in our Milky Way galaxy where we're being inundated with light waves and light particles. So we are ascending, whether we like it or not. And the only way to prevent that is to stay in the dark, dark emotions that are permeating our planet right now. Okay, so it's super positive to stay positive and have faith in the higher realms and the higher vibrational elements of the universe. And that will help us ascend and see... The reality is there are those beings in our galaxy that want to see humans fail at this earthly experiment and not to ascend. They want to keep us in fear so they can continue to have power over us. And see, if we are no longer afraid, then it's like, bye Felicia. And that's where the divine feminine and the Christ consciousness, and I'm not talking about religion. I'm talking about the highest vibration that a human being can embody while they're incarnated here, okay? Comes from your heart chakra. There's no fear involved in it. There is no anger. There's no hate. None of that can exist in that vibration, you see? So breathe. And I'm not saying that, you know, there are people that are called here now, and we've all chosen to be here now. But there are people that are being called to stand, go and take a stand and actual physically go out and stand up for what they believe in. Do it from your heart. You will have the angels beside you protecting you the whole way. But just come from a place of love and not of violence and hate. Because that's going to keep you down into this muck, right? Not saying anybody should do anything. I'm choosing to hold the light and hold the vision of a more conscious humanity full of love for each other. Okay, so that's what I'm doing. And I would say that everybody right now that has a conscious <laughs> speck in their being, hold the light, hold the vision of a better future. Hold it, see it, feel it. Give thanks for it now, okay? Help us get over this hump that we're gonna all have to get through. This is the week. It's going to be fine.